Hey guys, this is Surya from Skilllink. Uh, I'm here with another video in the same career series, right? The question that we are answering today is, I'm in my first or second year of mechanical engineering, or I'm a fresher in mechanical engineering. Which skilling course should I enroll in? Or in other words, how should I plan my career, right? Uh, so the question that we are asking you is, do you know what your area of interest is, right? What are the different area of interest? Is it design? Is it CFD, computational fluid dynamics? Is it structural analysis? Is it multi-body dynamics? Is it programming or is it electric vehicles, right? So in any of these, what is your area of interest, right? So in the previous uh, videos, we saw about design career. We saw about CFD career. We saw about uh, um, finite element analysis, which is structural analysis career as well. So today's video, it's going to be multi-body dynamics. Right. So if you are someone who is interested in kinematics of machinery, right. Uh, so if you are some someone who is uh, who likes KOM vibrations, then the domain that you are interested in is in multi-body dynamics. In multi-body dynamics, there are two ways to structure your career, right. So one way in multi-body dynamics is your robotics, right. Uh, the other way is vehicle dynamics. Uh, suspension design, steering kinematics, that's the other part of multi-body dynamics. So what is multi-body dynamics? As the name suggests, multiple bodies connected together, understanding the dynamics of the multiple bodies due to a force applied at one particular end of the body is called multi-body dynamics, right? So here what you can do is, if you are interested in automotive engineering, right? So the courses that you should look into is vehicle dynamics using MATLAB. Right. So this course basically looks into suspension design, tire modeling, vehicle ride, vehicle handling and how you can model them using a software called MATLAB. Then you can also look into suspension design using MSC Adams. MATLAB is a lot of mathematical coding. You understand the equations behind the vehicle dynamics and develop your own solvers in MATLAB. In uh, MSC Adams, MSC Adams is the uh, solver. So here you can look into suspension design using MSC Adams. There is also one theoretical course uh, in our platform, which is called Motorsport Racing with respect to vehicle dynamics. You can also take a look at this. Uh, the If you're interested in robotics, so something that you can look into is multi-body dynamics using motion view and motion solve uh, for both automotive and robotic applications. Okay, now the next question, right? So these are stage one courses, right? What is stage two? How do I move to stage two? Right. So stage two is where you focus on, say, uh, robotics or vehicle dynamics itself, but it has two phases. Say I'm taking vehicle dynamics using MSC Adams, right? Uh, there are in MSC Adams, there's something called Adams view where you build the models. So from the scratch. So it's the basics of model building in Adams view, right? Then you have Adams car where there is a template based approach which is basically whatever suspension that you have heard about previously there is a template already in uh, msa adams for that suspension uh, su suspension model what you need to do is just give your inputs and see what is the analysis right that is the basics of adams car say if you want to work on adams car in an advanced way you should look into template building. So template building is there for chassis, it's there for transmission, it's there for suspension as well. Here you build your own template of a suspension or a chassis or a transmission, right? This is the most advanced uh, aspect of uh, vehicle dynamics. Uh, you There is multiple softwares, MSA Adams is one of it, right? Uh, if you are interested in multi-body dynamics, this is the approach that you need to take into, right? Uh, great. So. We have looked into design, CFD, FEA, and MBD. So all so uh, the links for these three career paths are below this video. Uh, the multi-body dynamics uh, is what we are covering. Then we will also look into programming and electric vehicle in our next video. Okay. If you have any questions, please put it in the comments. Uh, I'll take a look at it, answer it, and try to also make a video out of it. Okay. Uh, thank you so much for following through this series. And if you have any questions, as I said, please put it down in the comments. Thank you, guys.